This week marks COP26, a climate change summit being held in Glasgow, where members of the royal family are to be in attendance and press the case for urgent action. While it was announced last week that the Queen will not be there, Prince Charles, 72, and his wife Camilla, Duchess of Cornwall, 74, and the Duke and Duchess of Cambridge, both 39, are still set to make an appearance and interact with the world leaders descending on the Scottish city. As both Charles and Prince William have widely commented publicly on the theme of climate change, Chris Shipp, ITV News Royal Editor took to Twitter to mention how billboards have been erected in Glasgow ahead of the conference by anti-monarchy campaign group Republic blasting the royals as hip hypocrites. The billboards claim that the future leaders are hypocrites for their usages of helicopter flights, private jets, multiple huge homes and personal train, while being so outspoken on the issue of climate change. Amid this wider row, Mr. Ship was then called out for the prevalent UK media coverage that discusses the use of private jets by Meghan Markle, 40, and Prince Harry, 37, with writing, and Chris I actually agree but surely you know can see the blatant hypocrisy that the Sussexes experience by mainly UK reporters. Not one reporter calling out senior royals' usage of jets, not one. However, the royal commentator hit back at the user to defend himself and the couple by writing, nor were Harry and Meghan criticized for taking private jets on official working business as I recall, well no one of sound judgment. So your point is a little lost on me. He further expanded on this in response to another user, by making reference to the usage of similar methods of transport used by US President Joe Biden by writing, just as Joe Biden has used Air Force One and a long motorcade for the G20 summit. It's business, before adding, although they should all look at doing it more sustainably. 742 Meghan Markle could get major rebrand in a bid to become a relatable author Meghan Markle's advisors are reportedly pushing for an overhaul of her public image after she received criticism for wearing expensive jewellery during a reading of her children's book The Bench. According to a royal commentator, the Duchess of Sussex could be set for a rebranding, in an attempt to boost sales of her books. She recently made a YouTube appearance where she gave a reading of her book The Bench, inspired by the relationship shared by her husband and son, but received criticism for the expensive accessories she wore during the clip. Royal commentator Neil Sean said, The biggest problem for Meghan and her advisors is how do they make her relatable to the people that they want to buy the book, that is the tricky bit. Now this particular interview on YouTube saw Meghan looking wonderful, basking in wonderful sunlight, but of course it was drawn to the fact that she was wearing a lot of expensive jewelry and an expensive watch. If you're trying to sell a book to children, that's not really relatable. Now what we can tell you, is that they're going to be rebranding Meghan as something of a more warm and comfy, open, relatable author.